Hello and welcome to MJ Studies. Today we will discuss about launch template and launch configuration. So first we will check what is launch template. A launch template is similar to a launch configuration in that it specifies instance configuration information. It includes the ID of the AMI, the instance type, a key pair, security groups and other parameters used to launch EC2 instance. However, defining a launch template instead of a launch configuration allows you to have multiple versions of a launch template. Now, what is a launch configuration? A launch configuration is an instance configuration template that an auto-scaling group uses to launch EC2 instance. When you create a launch configuration, you specify information for the instances. Now, as you see that both the definitions are a little bit the same. So what is the difference between launch template and launch configuration? So we'll check, go for, uh, for difference. So yeah, launch template uh, uh, is a more features uh, besides auto-scaling. Yeah, but a uh, launch configuration only allows you to uh, configure with auto scaling. Launch template supports multi versioning, but launch configuration won't support multi versioning. It's immutable. Launch template have uh, more modification features than launch configuration, but in launch configuration have limited configurations feature, limited modification feature. Yeah, and uh, launch template is recommended by AWS. Launch configuration won't recommended by AWS. It's a previous version. Yeah, now we'll see that how we can create a launch template and then launch config, uh, how we can create a launch configuration. Yeah, so to do the same, we need to go to services, then compute, then EC2. So first, we'll check for the launch configuration. So for launch configuration, in the site toolbar, you found the auto scaling. In auto scaling, you found launch configuration. Just go to launch configuration. Then when you click on create launch configuration, you found one notification from AWS that instead of using launch configuration to create your EC2 auto scaling group, we recommended that you use launch template and make uh, use of auto scaling uh, guidance option. So as AWS is recommended us to uh, select the launch template instead of launch configuration. That's a general uh, warning uh, notification. Yeah, so just uh, give a name. So we'll give a name to our launch configuration and just uh, D. Now AMI, uh, here we need to uh, first create an AMI uh, our own AMI because it won't uh, support the quick start AMIs which is uh, in AWS. Uh, so uh, either we can choose uh, AWS Marketplace AMIs or our own created AMIs. So we currently select any of the AWS Marketplace AMI just for uh, tutorial purpose. Now select the instance type. So we'll, we need to select the instance type. Any instance type we want. Uh, then we'll go for it. We are, currently, we go for T2 Micro. Yeah. After that, uh, if you want uh, the launch configuration to be started a sport instance, then you can request for a sport instance. Either you, uh, if you uncheck this, it means it's on demand instance. Now, go for, uh, now check for the instance profile. If you have IAM instance profile, then you can select this. Now, um, if you want to enable detailed monitoring, enhanced monitoring, then, can you, then you can enable from here. EBS optimization instance and more features are there. You can choose accordingly. Yeah. Apart from this, you can also choose the volumes. You can uh, remove and add volumes according to your use. So I am just removing the unused volume. I only put root volume over here, which is of 8 GB in size. Now here you can select the security group. In security group, I am using the existing security group. So yeah, we can choose security group MJ studies as we created earlier. Now we can also choose a key pair. If we don't have existing key pair, then we can choose new. I have existing key pair. So I'm choosing my existing key pair. Now just acknowledge that I have ex uh, the existing key pair available in my uh, in my system. So if I notify you, if you uh, check this. Yeah, now our launch template is ready. Our launch configuration is ready. So now I am creating the launch configuration. So as you see, our launch configuration is uh, created. But here is one issue arise that if I want to edit my launch configuration, if I want to modify my launch configuration from just like from instance type T2 micro to T2, uh, medium or T2, small or T2 large, then there is no option for this. I need to create another launch uh, configuration for that. Uh, so it, it, this is a drawback for uh, launch configuration. It won't support versioning. Now we'll go for launch uh, template. So yeah. Once we go for launch template, just click on uh, in the site toolbar, you found the option of launch template uh, here in the instances. And after that, just click on create a launch template. Uh, and after clicking, just give the name of a launch template, just like MG study. Now, if you want to give a version template, just like one, two, three or ABC, any of the version you want to give to this launch template, then you can give, uh, we'll give uh, version one. 
Where is one? Now, so here it will ask uh, provide guidance to help me set up the template that I can use it uh, in auto scaling. So if you check this, then it will uh, help you to select the template in auto scaling. Then it uh, oh, there is one uh, point. If you check this, then it ask you for the AMI. And if you uncheck this, then it the AMI is not required. You can select it in the later version or you can select in this version. It's your choice. So yeah, and after this, you can find the option that don't include a in launch template. So if you want to include this in launch template, then just search for the AMI with board which you want to create. So here it supports the quick quick start AMI is also your AMI also and the marketplace AMI is also. So I am selecting Ubuntu AMI here. Yeah. After that, it also asks you for uh, instance type. If you want to give instance type now, then you can. If you don't want to give it, then just don't give it. Uh, if you want to give it in other version any other modification all the, then you can also do this. I am giving the T2 Micro for of now. The key pair, every every option which you found here, you can give it in a later version also or in the same version also. It's up to you that what you want to select. Now I am selecting the security group. Before that I select the subnet. Now uh, check for the network advanced setting. If you want to change the advanced setting, then you can you are able to change the advanced setting. As launch template gives more feature, more configuration feature than launch configuration. Now here you can find the EBS, uh, so you can also modify the EBS according to your use. You can add the volume, uh, add the new volume, remove the volume according to your use. And it also gives you advanced detail. So, so in the advanced detail you can also add a user data script and more features according to your use, termination, protection, hibernation, behavior, shutdown, behavior and all those. You can set up over here. Now after this we will just click on launch, just check once check for the summary and check for the details which you filled. And after that, just click on create launch template. Once you click on create launch template, you will found your launch template uh, over here. So it uh, I'll just clicking on launch template, you found all the details over here. The versioning over here is this is the version one. And okay, I'll tell you that uh, we can update this launch template as many times as we want. So just check this uh, and modify. So if you want to modify, just click on modify template and create new version. So what I want to change in my uh, recent version, just like I want to change uh, either a, either uh, the AMI. I want to select the uh, Windows uh, Server 2022 as my base. So just select the AMI and now update. Yeah, now it's uh, selected. And I also want to uh, select uh, change the uh, instance type to T2 small. Then I can change it and just uh, create template version. As you see now, in the same in the same template. I created first one is the default one and I created two versions and the other one let me check the bo let me uh, tell you about both the versions so here you uh, see that all both the versions are here here the version one is our first version and version two is our second version uh, so if you want to use second version then you can uh, check this and just click on two so now the two is uh, at the default version and, and now the two is in use and the first one is not in use if you check for the first one then the first version is in use yeah that's the feature of launch template uh, apart from the launch configuration which uh, don't provide versioning yeah thank you for uh, watching this video and if you have any doubt feel free to subscribe uh, feel free to comment below please like share and subscribe mj studies goodbye